Hi, I'm Ashley from FangirlsAreWe.com, and I'm going to be talking to you about fashion, specifically fandom fashion, and how and where to find it, and once you find it, how to piece it together to make yourself look totally awesome. So I personally am a really big fan of fashion and makeup and that whole world, but I'm also a really big fan of all things that are nerdy, and I like to marry the two together to make awesome, cool, fashionable looks. And I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, Ashley, no. Fashionable and nerdy do not belong in the same sentence. That is an oxymoron. And to that I say, you're an oxymoron. That's not, that's not a good insult. But I am on a one girl mission to prove viewpoints like that wrong by putting together what I consider to be kick-ass outfits. <laughs> so you're welcome. I think one important thing about fashion, or it's a rule that I like to follow, is just to take one statement piece. And so you take that piece, you put that on, and you dress around that. A lot of the times that might be a fandom tee. In the past few years, it's gotten a little bit easier for girls who are nerdy to find items in stores that pertain to their needs and that are wearable and that fit them properly. It's still, it's still a little difficult and I still find myself occasionally shopping in the men's department because, you know, I don't want like all pink superhero ensemble or something like don't know what the, the obsession is with dripping pink on it and being like, this is for women. I don't want it. <laughs> so I still will occasionally buy a shirt that's like a size or two smaller than I would normally need in, in a men's size so that it like doesn't look like it's a men's shirt. And that's how I do it and then I'll like pair it with Something like this, that's actually what I'm doing today. I'm wearing a men's shirt that I got from one of my brothers for my birthday. And I'm pairing it with like an army, what do you call this, like a fatigue? And this is a Captain America shirt. And then I pair it with like a bandage dress. So you, it's got a little bit of like, it's bigger on the top, smaller on the bottom. Whatever that means. Where do I usually get my fandom clothing? I've gotten my clothing at a series of different places. Um, Target, occasionally. I've gotten shirts from Target, and usually in the men's department. Um, Hot Topic is a good place to find some good fandom and novelty related things. Um, they can be, a, they're expensive, but they're cheap sometimes, and that's not fun. Cause I've gotten, I've gotten like hundreds of shirts from Hot Topic and most, I don't think I own any of them anymore because they've all died. Tragic deaths, holy deaths. So, I'd say beware when you're trying to find an outfit at Hot Topic. Check to see if the material is not going to be easily punctured, because that's annoying. Um, I've also, I have shirts from like Walmart and Kohl's. Um, Her Universe is a really cool place to get fandom related outfits, because um, it's, it's it's specifically designed for women, by women, and they're really cute little outfits. I love the little dresses. They've got cute little like sundresses that will turn you into a Dalek and things like that. And that's awesome and that's cool and I really like those. Accessory wise, Etsy is a good place occasionally to find fandom stuff and cool homemade stuff and you get to support artists and creators 
and that's cool. Um, or you can make your own. I've done that with a few items, and if you want to see how to do that, I can show you how to do that. Um, or sometimes you just like, you'll go into a store and you'll see something that reminds you of a character and you'll buy it. Um, I have a, I have an octopus necklace that my dad refers to as the Hydra necklace and I like to wear that in my outfits to kind of give like a cool like badass vibe and I pretend I'm part of Hydra. I don't know. I've got these earrings right here, if you can see them, and they're a little they're little stars. They kind of give a little like Winter Soldier vibe. So like things like that. If you see something that reminds you of a character, snatch it up and take it home and put it into an outfit. That's basically like what I'm about. I like to like take pieces and parts and put them together into a solid, cohesive look. I hope all that made sense. I'm going to put links in the description to the things that I've mentioned in this video along with things that I forgot to mention in this video because I'm forgetful. Thanks for watching and check out fangirlsarewe.com. Ashley out. I really like fashion and makeup and boop de boop de boop.